is unusually sunny for this time of year in the east. Cloud and rain, heavy at times, will soon spread from the west later today. <laughs> and that is how I spend my Sunday afternoon, covered in flour with butter splatter on my whole kitchen. <laughs> All that when you could have just bought a cake from a bakery. Nothing can beat a homemade raspberry cheesecake. So, Arnold, what do you do? I'm an investment banker, but I'm also a part-time party animal. <laughs> I hope to open a huge club for you. Arnold Jones? I told you not to bother me for stupid things. I don't care. Just handle it. Where was I? Do you know what? Just tell me about yourself. Uh, yeah, sure. Um, I'm a nurse at the Children's Hospital that's down the lane from here. Um, I love my job. The hours do get really long, but it is worth it to watch the kids be happy and healthy again. Um, and I also live around the corner in case I'm needed for emergency cases. Um, I'm sorry, did I miss something? What? No, nothing. I was just thinking how your future husband and kids might have to live off take -outs. What brings you here, Arnold? A friend of mine thought it was about time I stopped fooling around and try finding something more meaningful. So here we are on this blind date. What about you? <laughs> well, um, it's been a while since I got off an awful relationship and um, I thought it was time for me to get out there again. Really? What happened? We were really great in the beginning. Then he slowly started to show his other side. He had um, anger issues, issues with me spending too much time at work. So one day as I was getting ready, he asked me to change into something less eye-catching less eye-catching. We were going to a cocktail party. <laughs> so naturally, I killed the bastard. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah? And how did you do it? Step him six times in the neck with my tweezers. They are much like myself, more powerful than they look. Oh, I have to head back to the hospital now. Um, it was lovely meeting you, Arnold. You too. Oh, well, I'll get that. Kent Police Department haven't been able to identify the murder weapon that was used to stab the 28-year-old. The lead subject, his girlfriend, has been missing for about six days now. The autopsy report has noted the object.